Alright everyone, Voodoo5292, welcome to yet another channel update. Uh, this one covers uh, today, Monday, August, August, I'm way behind the times, October the 3rd of 2011 through October the 9th, which is a Sunday, of 2011. And uh, as we usually do, let's start off by talking about what happened last week. And last week, I, the first thing I did was finish up the Lonesome Road DLC for Fallout New Vegas, the last story-based DLC, um, which was pretty interesting. Uh, it wasn't too long, and I only, it only took me two days to beat it, uh, but it was different. It was a different kind of DLC. It was a much more linear DLC um, with some pretty interesting characters, and you find out some pretty interesting things about your past, and it kind of wraps up... Uh, the story of, of Fallout New Vegas, so I recommend you go watch it. It's a pretty good playthrough, pretty funny at parts when I encounter some uh, some unexpected death claws and uh, have a difficult time, so it's pretty funny, I think, in some parts, so I would recommend going check that out. It's not too long, uh, so I did that. Uh, then I jumped into the Gears of War 3 campaign and uh, played a little bit of that here and there over the course of the week. Um, on Thursday night, uh, the Battlefield 3 open beta came out and I sat down and I played a little bit of it. I didn't play too much of it. I played about six parts, I think. Uh, there's a couple reasons for that. Um, one, a couple of my friends here in the apartment had already downloaded it and therefore um, I had played a couple of matches already just to try it out before I started filming. Another reason was it was pretty late when I started playing and it was a, I had school the next day, uh, class. And so I, I didn't play too late. And then the other thing was, was there's only one game mode on one map. And, uh, you know, it, it gives you a pretty good taste of the gameplay. But after playing the same map over and over again on the same mode, I got a little tired of it. But I do have Battlefield 3 beta footage up from Thursday. Um, so that's what I did last week. I'm right in the middle of the Gears 3 campaign. So with that being said, let's go ahead and talk about this week coming up. And what's going on. So, again, unfortunately, as is, is becoming usual, unfortunately, through this semester, because this is, this is the most difficult you know, school experience I've had in my life so far with this semester, uh, I find myself again in a time crunch. Because, first of all, let me say this. It's hard for me to believe right now that I'm only as far in Gears of War 3 as I am. Because it seems like the couple of days I've played it, I've sat down and put some good time into it. But when I look at it, I've only got 14 parts so far, which is surprising. And I'm going to say why I think that I've, I've felt like I've played so long, but I haven't. And I know when I say this, I, all the fanboys are going to go crazy and comment all over this video and say stuff. But everybody just needs to relax. Um, to be honest with you, the reason that... I think I feel like I've played so long because so far I've found the game to be very repetitive. And to be honest, I'm not enjoying the game that much. Now, I'm not I'm not making a judgment here or anything like that because I haven't beaten the campaign, I haven't played the multiplayer mode, blah, blah, blah. And maybe it's because I haven't played Gears 1 or Gears 2. That could be a contributing factor. But just jumping in playing Gears of War 3 for right now, it hasn't been that great of an experience. It's basically walk around killing shit. That's pretty much what it is so far, and the way the gameplay is going pretty much is basically there's these stalks that come out of the ground that release what they call lambent, and basically so far the gameplay has been, oh look, another stalk has appeared. Kill the lambent. Okay, so you do that, you clear the area, and then you walk up a little bit. Oh look, another stalk. Kill that, walk up a little bit, cutscene, walk up. Oh look, another stalk. Like, that's what's been the gameplay so far. And I'm about three and a half hours in, but I'm not saying judgment, I'm reserving judgment until I've played the full game, until I've tried the multiplayer. But here's the problem, okay? I have the rest of the campaign to finish, and all the multiplayer modes, meaning all of the versus mo modes, uh, the new beast mode, and horde mode to play. And it's Monday. I'm getting a new game in two days. Problem being is, I have a lot of shit to do for school, as usual. I have a biology test on Wednesday. I've got a lot of things I need to be doing tonight just to keep up with my classes. I need to be doing calculus homework. I need to be doing um, 
Oh yeah, by the way, speaking on that note, my entire calculus class is failing um, the class um, because of the test that the teacher gave, and he's not curving, uh, which is awesome. I got a 56%, and I was number 10 in the entire class of 39 on the test. The highest score we, that, that Chris and I, who were in the same class, have heard was a 63 on the test, and that was the fourth best. So for the most part, everybody except maybe four or five people is failing the class, um, and he's not curving. So I'm in a good situation there. So I need to be doing calculus. I have an organic chemistry test coming up next week. So I have other things that I need to be doing. Um, but I'm going to try to play campaign for Gears of War 3 tonight. I don't know how much I'm going to be able to do before I get passed out from exhaustion. I don't know what time I'm going to be starting because i got to do some schoolwork before I jump in. So, I don't know what's going to happen with Gears 3, but we'll continue to play it and do what we can. Moving on from Gears 3, there are multiple new releases this week, but the only one that I'm going to be attempting to play is Rage, which has been confirmed. They've already sent my copy out this morning, so I should have it on Wednesday. Um, here's the deal with Rage. I originally was going to get the game for the Xbox 360, no particular reason, just, you know, again, as I, as I like to do since I've got the 360, kind of mix it up, play some games on 360, some games on PS3. What I find out is, is that the game for Rage is so huge that on Xbox 360, the game is three discs, and on PS3, there's an 8 gigabyte install. So I said, wow, that sucks either way, but, you know, what... what what is going to be, you know, what's going to aggravate me less? And I just, and I, you know, made the decision that having the game on one disc but having a bigger install is going to be less aggravating than sitting there and keep swapping out three discs for the 360. So I got the game for the PS3, and I'll be installing it, and then as soon as I beat it, I'm going to be uninstalling the 8 gigs from my memory because that's obscene. Um, but I only have two weeks to play Rage before... Arkham City comes out, so, and if the game is that big, and I have all this stuff to do, then I don't know when I'm going to be able to beat Rage. So, again, as I said before, extreme time crunch right now, and, and it's just, I'm trying to make this work, but there's so many games right now, and I just have so little time, that it's becoming very difficult. Um, but, that's my intention this week. I, I can't tell you exactly what the schedule is going to be for Gears or anything like that. I'm going to see what I can do with Gears of War 3 tonight. Um, tomorrow, I don't think I can play anything. I can't play Gears at all tomorrow night, I don't think, because I have a math, I mean, a uh, biology test on Wednesday that I have to study hardcore for, and uh, I don't get back until after 6 o'clock at night here on Tuesday. So I'm going to be coming back, eating dinner, and then hitting the books tomorrow night, Tuesday, so I don't think I'm going to be able to play it at all. Um, so anyway, that's the deal. I don't know. Maybe, you know, I don't know what's going to happen. I really don't. I'm going to just do my best, try to juggle what I have. Um, now, Memo, I may be looking for people. In fact, I probably will be looking for people to play Horde Mode with me, if they would like. I know I have a couple of uh, a couple of fans who follow me who have an Xbox 360 and are very big Gears fans. So... Uh, I'm putting this memo out now. I might need, or I may be looking for people to play Horde Mode with me. Um, problem is, I have no idea when I'm getting around to playing Horde Mode, and I can't give you a time or date yet. Um, if I look at my schedule and, you know, can find a good time or date, uh, time and date, I should say, to play Horde Mode, I will probably make a, a quick video and post it up and say, listen, you know, on this day and this date, I'm planning on playing Horde Mode, um, does anybody want to, you know, to play with me? Um, so I'm just throwing it out there now in case, you know, to see if there is interest in doing that. And we'll go from there. But this week you'll see, all I can tell you is you'll see more Gears 3 footage and you will see the beginning of Rage, uh, which I'm looking forward to, to trying to get through because it looks like a really sweet game. It's from id software who back in the day made games such as doom such as quake and um it should be pretty cool it looks like like almost like a very dark borderlands or a very dark 
Fallout or something like that. Not that Fallout's not... Fallout, I wouldn't say, has an extreme dark overtone to it. Um, but this game certainly looks like it does. It's being published by Bethesda, so... Usually that means good things, except if the game is Brink, which Bethesda should have never fucking published, ever. No company should have ever published that horrendous piece of shit game, but they did. Um, but anyway... So, that's what's going on this week. I will be doing a game review of Gears of War 3 whenever I'm able to beat the campaign and play some of the multiplayer. Uh, but yeah, we'll just have to see what happens in this time crunch situation. I hope to play a decent amount of it tonight, but again, I can't guarantee that. So, we'll see what happens. But stick in there. Uh, more Gears 3 footage this week, and also more... Or not more of, but the, but the beginnings of Rage footage, which I have two weeks to play. I have no idea if I'll be able to get through the game in two weeks, but I should be able to get through a good amount of it in two weeks. Uh, and then we hit Batman Arkham City, and then Battlefield 3 on the 25th. So, pretty good games coming out this month. Uh, and, again, I just hope that I'm able to get to them all and, uh, and play them. So, uh, Voodoo 5, 12, 92, thanks guys. Be looking for new gameplay footage tonight and through the week. Thanks.